Well, the community is remembering a nine-year-old girl who was killed when she and her mother were run over in West Asheville yesterday. 27-year-old Harry Kimmons is charged with first-degree murder. Now, police say he deliberately ran over his fiance Jennifer Simpson and her daughter, Erica Phillips, while they walked on the sidewalk along Smoky Park Highway. A makeshift memorial has been set up at the scene of that accident. News 13's Emma Wright has more. Well, everybody hurts in the same spot. A growing memorial to nine-year-old Erica Phillips sits on the side of Smoky Park Highway. Perfect strangers stop to remember the little girl they only know from TV. I don't know the kid. I don't know the, I don't know the mom. I don't know her family. But I do know that, that she would hurt like I would. And I hurt like she does, you know. Phillips' tragic ending made news Thursday afternoon when police say her mother's fiance, 27-year-old Harry Kimmins, ran them over while they were walking on the sidewalk. Erica's tragic ending strikes a chord in the community. There's a lot of words that cannot describe how much of a monster this man was. You know, I mean, it's one thing to do something to yourself. It's another thing when you take it out on an innocent child. 24 hours later, a colorful pile of teddy bears and flowers sits in what was once a crime scene. Jenna Tullis stopped by to add a bouquet. Because she was really nice and she, like I said, she was my friend in second grade. She was always giving and caring for other people. What happened to Erica isn't lost on her young friend. People said that her dad had run her over and that um, she died right there with, and her mom's in the hospital now. Jenna's dad says it was a tough day at school. Very difficult, especially with the way that it happened. It's very hard for a child to understand. Hard to understand and comprehend, crying for a little girl whose life ended much too soon. It really bothers me. The whole, the whole, the whole thing bothers me. Well, Erica's mother, Jennifer Simpson, is in the intensive care unit of Mission Hospital tonight. She's in fair condition. Evelyn Charities has set up a fund to help Erica's family with medical and funeral expenses. And you can either mail donations to Evelyn Charities or go to EvelynCharities.org and click the donate button and put Erica Phillips as the designee.